Drifting is a driving maneuver where the driver of a car intentionally steers too much, causing the car's rear tires to lose their grip on the road. Some people do it for fun, some people do it in competition, and some people suggest that trains can do the same thing. I'm not going to be surprised if things get a little crazy from here on out, so make sure you watch till the end to see how things pan out. Otherwise, if you like what you see today, make sure you like the video, subscribe, drop a comment down below, tell me what you want to see next. But that's all I have to say right now. Let's get the video started. So the first thing I want to do, and uh, if this doesn't work, you won't see this video. Um, the first thing I want to do is see if let's get a let's get a switch because that's how this whole thing works. I'm pretty sure I did it on 19. I'm trying to remember another immersive railroading video I made, and I want to say at 19 radius is where it managed to perfectly match up. I'm basically going to test whether or not, okay, so it wasn't 19. I need to figure out what radius this needs to be. Give me a sec. I think it was this one. Yes, okay. And then this is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven straight. This is gonna be a bit of a chore, but I have an idea. So how on earth did, okay, never mind. Let's get it to like here-ish. And then we'll hit the brakes and then we'll hit this. Let me add some more straight track over here. Cause I'm just trying to see if this works right now. Cause if this works, we are absolutely in business. Okay, so brakes off, give it a little more throttle. And we're just waiting to see if the train rotates. <gasps> Let's go. Okay. Oh my gosh, this just got so exciting. If I, okay, okay, hang on, hang on. Bear with me for a second. Bear with me for a second. Let's find a turn. Let's say we set this to 36 which is twice the other one. Can I do this? Tell me this is going to work. I don't know if that's going to work, but you know what? Honestly, let's just find out. That could be close enough. We're going to hop back in here and we're going to go brakes off, a little bit of throttle. I need to know if this is going to switch around. No, it linked back up to the thing. Okay. You're going to stop because I know how you behave now. Okay. What if I used a custom curve? Let's see if I can figure this out. Place blueprint. Uh, custom curve. Bang. I'm trying to remember how to do this. And then I was like, bang. And then I came over here and I was all like, bang. Let's see if this works. I really hope this works. This would be so funny if it worked. Please work. Please work. <gasps> this just, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, 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 custom curves are amazing. Okay, so now with that, with that, like, solved, I think it's time. Oh my gosh, this is gonna be awesome. Okay, so I think what I want to do is I want to do like a big figure eight around these two, like, villages here. So let's do this, 90 return. Let's go 50, right? This should be plenty to get around this village, right? Oh, it's breaking something i need to stop this from flowing out what what is what is holding it up now no don't go that way go that way what is holding it up nothing there's nothing oh is it the freaking path block right here that's being extra silly i really if, if that's the case i'm gonna be pooze wow it literally was just that one single path block all right i'm going to fill this water because i know trains are gonna break through this but i'm not worried about it okay because what i'm thinking is we're gonna do like this way and then that way and then swing back around. So what I need to do is I need to come over here. This is this is this is gonna be amazing when it works. Okay, so you go there, and we're gonna plow through some houses. But oh, I need to freaking get rid of some path blocks. Why are path blocks so stupid? I'm just gonna get rid of them because then I can just do like ground fill and not worry about it. And then we're gonna be like uh, rail bed fill, cobblestone, bang. No, is it real bed? Bang. What? What just broke? I'm not sure what's happening. Whatever, dude. I'll just move it. God. Okay, let's go 60. Let's go 60. Let's go 70. Whatever. 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 74. If I do this, will it work the way I think it will? Yes, it will. Ha! <laughs> Oh, this is going to be glorious. Okay, so we've got our first track, or the first, like, return. All right, this one was 50, so I'm going to make it 54 and head over here. Okay. Uh, okay, we're having some freezes. Don't like to see that, but it's fine. So now, what has to happen is I'm going to do this. We're going to go... Okay, place blueprint. We're going to do this, and we're going to face this way, and we're going to put it 
here. I like the way this looks. So we're gonna do this. Then for this one, we're gonna do same thing. But when we get to over here, I'm gonna put this on the other side because that will make it, yes, that's gonna make it cross over, which is what we want it to do. I'm worried that that's gonna make it snap. I don't think it will though. There's no way to find out until we test though, which, uh, you know, stay tuned, but hopes are high. I'm really hoping that this mess of uh, tracks intersecting each other isn't gonna, you know, cause problems for this because I really, really desperately want this to work. Okay, and it's gonna be a gentle transition into this last one, but that should be fine. And uh, yeah, I'm, gonna, I'm not gonna make the angle on this next one that severe. I'm starting to drop some frames, but that's okay. Oh no, it was just because it was like a, the blueprint. That's fine, I think. I think. I am dropping a few frames. Uh, I don't know how visible it is on video, but it's probably because of all the track, but that's fine. This is definitely worth it. So far, I see little reason for it to not work. Um, which way do I want this to go? Let's make it go this way. So how I'm actually going to get it on the track is with a little bit of uh, wizardry. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to go switch. So those should meet up. Perfect. And now I need to do that, recreate the setup I had on the other one. So let's try... I really want to see if I can get these to... Wait, if I do a switch blueprint, can I customize the... Uh... Can I actually customize the turnout? Oh, that would be so nice. Let's see. Oh, that's so nice. I had no idea. Oh my gosh. This just got so much more like convenient. I didn't realize you could use the golden spike for turnouts. That's so... That just... That just like... Oh my gosh. That's going to be so like convenient. But the time has come for us to test our uh, multi-track drifting circuit. I don't know what else to say, I'm just gonna do it. <laughs> the front one needs to exit on the turnout first, so I'm actually gonna do this. Turn it on, go forward until we go through the thing, then I need to stop it, and I need to flip the switch, and if, I really hope this works. I really hope this works. Let's, let's just do a slow, let's do a slow one. So we're drifting. Nice transition. Oh my gosh. This is actually so cool. Nice smooth transition. This is this is great. <laughs> oh my gosh, I can't believe this is working. Let's get a view of the transition on this side. In, in you go. Oh, he's going a little fast. Nice. Clutch kick. Oh, it goes a little tighter over here. Dude. I was not expecting this to be this easy. So that can only mean one thing. Uh, uh okay. Okay. <laughs> I have just thought of something horrendous. I doubt this is going to work, but we are going to give it a try. Okay. So now we do this. No. Okay. Let's go forward. Let's see if we can trick the game. I don't think this is going to work. I don't know if I should be trying this. Okay. Yeah, no, I don't think this is going to work for this. Okay. It was worth a shot. Let's try something else. Does the maglev like technically have bogeys? Surely it does. Because if this is the case, we are about to have some crazy drifting. Oh, wait, no. Turn the thing on. Then make it go. Okay, stop. No way. Okay. So we need to stop because I want to add some coaches to this. And I want to zigzag it. And that is how we're going to end this video. This has been a small experiment, but I do believe our findings have been quite fruitful. <laughs> so now we need to zigzag this. So right now we're going straight. So now I need to go forward. I wonder if I can do this on the fly. I should be able to. Oh no, what am I doing? 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 <laughs> and then one more. Uh oh! <laughs> Dude! Uh-uh. <laughs> There's only one thing left for it. Full speed! Someone needs to take this mod away from me. Oh, this is bizarre to look at. I want to see what this looks like from here. Oh, that's so weird. That's so weird. Oh, it's like every two coaches, it forms like an angle. That's so weird. Also, sheesh, it's going kind of fast. Oh, look at that. <laughs> this is awesome. Oh my gosh. Why did you stop? What happened? What happened? See, it looks like it. Oh, 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 oh. I was going to say, it looks like it is perpetually derailing, but via some logic, 
Uh, okay, I think it's I, I I think the game is starting to dislike me in general. So here's what's gonna happen. I'm gonna go in here. Oh, this isn't technically where the thing is. Oh, we could be in trouble. Oh, we could be in big trouble. Ah ah! Whoa. Okay. I I broke it. Ah! That worked. <laughs> Okay, let's get something a little slower, a little more gentle, and we'll just kind of cruise through this and we'll end the video. Let's get an S4 and we'll get a little flat car and I will stand on this flat car as the train goes through. Oh, I can stand here. Then you know what? I'm not gonna do the flat car. I didn't realize I could stand on the edge of that. That's fun. Go on. Oh, I didn't even notice the wheels were voxel too. I mean, I could have assumed so, but it's still interesting. Can I walk through this? I can. Give it some throttle. We're not too far, are we? Oh! We're chilling. Let me just stand in the front here, give it a little more juice, and outro this video. So, oh my gosh, I just need to like get a look at this. Let's go full throttle with this. Why not? Look at this. <laughs> this is awesome. <laughs> I love how gentle and smooth the custom curves make it too. And also, you can do custom curves with turnouts. That's like, God, I'm so glad I learned that. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm gonna turn the, I'm gonna turn the speed on this down before it really starts complaining. But that is gonna be this video. I wasn't expecting this to work as well as it has, but um, I suppose that's what happens when you ask questions you learn. And oh boy, have we learned. That is gonna be this video. So if you like this video and you wanna see more stuff like this, do consider subscribing and sharing this video to your friends, places, things, and blah, blah, blah. Head down to the description and join our Discord server. We have a lot of fun there and get some merch capitalism. But that's good for this video, and I will see you all in the next one. Talk to you guys later. Uh, bye. I'm trying to jump, and it doesn't let me jump. Get off the train. Uh, bye. <laughs>